What is SNR? One of the top things that govern a lot of the decisions we make as MRI technologists is SNR, or signal to noise ratio. But what is SNR and why is it so important? Well, let's start with signal. Signal is a measurement created by converting analog information represented by some continuous physical data such as spatial position or voltage to a digital value that is then transferred to a computer. Hmm, interesting, right? To be clear, MRI signal is a measurement that converts the resident's data from our tissues to a digital value representing pixel intensity. Understanding this concept will help you understand how things like procession frequency, Faraday's law of induction, relaxation, and FID are related to pulse sequence types and how parameters like received bandwidth can affect our image signal. Okay, so that's signal. What is noise? Noise generally is unwanted background slash electronic noise that is collected during digital conversion. The more noise, the more grainy it is. Think about it like this. Signal is a light that is coming out of this flashlight. Our received bandwidth is the distance between the flashlight and where the light meets the wall. Noise is the air in between them. The more you increase your received bandwidth, your signal goes down. It's not because you're collecting less signal. It's because the higher the received bandwidth, the more noise you let in, and it drowns out your signal. So, SNR is the battle between signal you want and the noise you don't want. So pick your weapon wisely. Thanks for watching. ROI of the week. Hit, make sure you like and subscribe. Cut!